this video, I'm going to show you the AI tool Auto Classmate. And Auto Classmate has a variety of tools built into it. Um, some of them are you need to have an account and pay for the tool. A lot of the tools here at Auto Classmate are currently free. So let's scroll down and see what kind of tools Auto Classmate has. So you'll see they're clearly labeled, whether they're not, they're coming soon, they're not in existence yet, or they're a freemium tool, which means some aspects of the tool is free. Some have, it has some paid parts to it. Um, premium tools mean, means you need to have a paid account, but you can see there are several free tools um, that you can use right here with Auto Classmate. So let's take a look at uh, this AI powered lesson gener lesson plan generator. Um, let's give this one a try. Now I uh, currently do not have an account to Auto Classmate. I am using all of the free options uh, when I use this tool. So it'll give you a little bit of information about what it is that this tool does. And then you'll have a form that you need to fill out. So let's say I am doing um, social studies and we're doing, today we're going to do fifth grade social studies. So I'm going to put the grade level in. So I'm going to say fifth grade. And here I can just simply type in what it is that I want my stu students to learn or I can actually use a standard. And so I've identified a standard here um, that I'm going to use and I'm going to paste that standard in. Now I'm gonna give it the content area, which is social studies. And one thing I really like is the ability to um, add state standards. We definitely want to link it with state standards. So I'm going to say yes here and I'm going to click generate lesson plan. Now it will take a few minutes for the AI to work. And as you, <laughs> you can see, it's already started working, generating this lesson plan right before our very eyes. So we'll give it a minute to uh, create the lesson plan and then we'll get, take a look at it. Now remember with AI, um, this is great. This is a great starting point, but you always need to go back through and read through anything that is AI generated. There are things in here that you may not use at all. There are things in here that you think, well, that's crazy. Why would I do that with fifth graders? So those are things that you wouldn't necessarily use. Um, but it did uh, link to um, standards. And let's take a look. Let's see what we have here. So here are my learning objectives. The standard is listed, tells me the materials that I need, the procedures, including about how much time that should take, hands-on activity, a conclusion. It gives me some ideas for assessment. And again, it connects to the standards. So we're gonna say, we're gonna give this a title. You can, you need to also, if you're, if you're using this without an account, you will need to put your name and your email address in each time you generate a lesson plan. And then you can choose if you want to subscribe to the lesson plan, if you want to agree, and then you can save this lesson plan. And what this is going to do is generate that lesson plan in a format that is um, downloadable. So here is the lesson plan that as is, I didn't make any changes to it. I could have made changes on that previous screen. Now, if I have an account, I can actually save this to my account. But um, since I'm using the free version, I'm gonna go ahead and download this as a PDF. And so this will create a PDF, very nice PDF, um, formatted and highlighted, and all of that information that it included in the lesson plan is now generated in this PDF. Um, and from here, I can download this, I can save this to my Google Drive um, and uh, be able to have this lesson plan. So if I go back to the site, um, you can see that I can make a new lesson plan or remember we had several different tools that we could look at. So let's go back to the AI tools and let's try a different tool. So I have a lesson that a couple of tools that aren't available yet, um, but I can, uh, the activation and engagement activity generator. So this will produce three engagement acti activities designed to add flair to a lesson plan. So I could take that lesson plan that I did, just did, and I could feed that into this engage engagement activity generator. 
um, and it would generate some engaging activities for me. Or I can just simply select a grade level, and again, what I want students to learn, and then it will generate those activities for me. Let's take a look at one of these other tools, which is the Would You Rather Question Generator. This is always kind of a fun activity to do with students to give them, you know, some creative thought time, to give them some uh, writing prompt. Um, and again, so let's go ahead and we'll say fifth grade. And what do I want them to give me Would You Rather questions on? How about historical figures? We'll just, we'll just try that. And then you can say, what kind of would you rather questions would you like? Maybe you just want to do this as a quick warm up activity, as so your spark, your uh, creative writing, and then you creative writing activity, you would do observe and hilarious, funny, serious, intellectual. So you have different choices that you can, let's do, let's do funny and um, say yes or no here. If you say yes, you're going to have to put your name in again. So if you say no, and then generate your responses. Let's see what, let's see what it comes up with. It is now working through our request and it is generating some would you rather questions on historical characters. So let's see what we have. Would you rather have a sleepover with George Washington or Abraham Lincoln? Would you rather time travel with Albert Einstein or Marie Curie? And it gives you, you know, 10 different choices here. So uh, these would you rather, the would you rather question generator, I just think that's a fun tool. Um, and again, you can download this as a PDF if you want to keep these questions um, for perpetuity. And then you could put this in your Google Drive or you'd have access to these questions um, after, you, after you're done using the tool. So um, again, if we go back to AI tools with Auto Classmate, you've got, a, you've got several choices here. I really like the lesson plan generator um, and the would you rather question generator. But again, you can try out all of these tools. If they're free, you can use them fully for free. If it says freemium, some of it, some parts are free, some parts you have to have a paid account for. Um, but this is Auto Classmate, a great tool uh, that has artificial intelligence tools created for educators by educators.